Harry De Luca, tell us about the day before happiness is finally arriving in America in November. What book is it? A book about Napoli, a story about Napoli after the Second World War. And there is a proverb in Napoli. They say, I have to teach you and I have to lose you. And that's what happens to this young boy. He has, been, he has been taught by the town, by a, a doorman who teaches him his story, his own story. He's an orphan, but he, the doorman knows uh, his father and his mother. And at, at the age of 18 uh, of the boy, the doorman tells him the story. And he answers to the story with uh, uh, rage, love, and blood. It's a story, obviously, that uh, you knew and heard when you were a kid. Of course, of course, all my stories uh, is, are part of the material that has made me uh, grow. The oral stories, the ghosts that were in Naples, the void uh, left by the bombs, and um, the noise of the alarm uh, uh, of bombing area, uh, air bombings. The air bombings over Naples, right? Over it. Yeah. How dear is this uh, book to you? How important is this book for you? It's one of the stories of mine, of my place, in which I uh, have uh, had experience of my fundamental s feelings and s like. Uh, Compassion, anger, and uh, shame. And uh, the book uh, came out in Italy. Tell us when the book came out in Italy and uh, uh, why this book in America now? In Italy, my little, my little literary career is always growing. So every book... Uh, um, deepens my my presence among the readers, and um, I have no. There is well, a very well sold book, and um, and sold in uh, other languages, of course, because I am uh, I have the chance, the luck to be well translated and well accepted in many languages or, um, or a part of Italy. And this moment is the, this is the moment for my presence in the United States with, with this story. In this story, this story regards a bit also the United States because in this story is told the uprising of Napoli in the months of uh, the month of September 43, when in the, during the war, the uprising of the Napoli people against the Nazi, against the, the uh, German army, allows the Americans to arrive and to come in Naples without uh, a single fire shot. Hmm like uh, quite a, on a carpet and uh, Napoli is, has been the only town in Italy who became free of Nazi occupation by its own without any help of military forces like just as a popular uprising four days the four days of Napoli in this book is named, uh, is entitled 
the day before happiness, because one of the days before happiness is the third day of the uprising, when the Neapolitans know, understand that the next day they will be happy and free. Thank you. Grazie. Grazie. <laughs>